Hi all. I want to talk with you about we are guaranteed to find an addiction before we die. We must take control of it. So I was probably like you thinking that I never had an addiction until until 2017. I would say between I would say I think it was June 2017 or May 2017 between between April and between April and June between April between April and July sorry between April and June 2017 I discovered that I'm addict I'm addicted to exercising I love to feel my heartbeat and be puffed out of breath and chasing for buses running around under on the underground on the on up 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 long long escalators on the undergrounds i wasn't even taking one step at a time i was taking two steps running up running sprinting up there and i wasn't even waiting on the right hand side where everybody else wants to stand and let the escalators pull them pull themselves up the pull themselves up the up up to the top of the of, of the level of the the first floor or the first ground the, the main ground out of the underground so I was doing that a lot and it was only started this year or if we, I think also last in the and uh, a, a, a while back before that it, what, what what happened was I I I just just wasn't feeling well when I was at the gym wasn't feeling well and I began to began to get sweaty and and pale skinned not just that i it was it only happened the, the, the this recent one that happened in 2017 i only i only did five I only did five minutes on the cardio really and that i did it in the way till my heart started pumping and that's when i started becoming unwell then i then there was points where i couldn't there were points where i had to keep my eyes closed this was during the daytime and I couldn't, couldn't, I couldn't look at look at the light. And when this happened, when this was happening before this, just before this happening, uh, this, just before this was happening, I had one bar, one bar of uh, of one bar of one bar of uh, one bar of uh, of, uh, of a natural 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 supp supplement as in one one bar of it it was a bar it was it's was, you had peanuts and peanuts you had nuts and 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 dates on it is i had a very small bite because I, I i have i have heard that you can exercise on on an empty stomach but i can't really exercise, exercise i can't really exercise on an empty stomach and not just that if I exercise on a yeah like I said about empty stomachs and I and I can't exercise just after I've eaten just after I've eaten two hours after I've eaten because I start to feel a bit sort of like full and I can't yeah so I had one bite and stuff not just that I'm on I was on I'm, I'm on I'm on medication risperidone two milligram with that so and that's a low dosage apparently so it's, it's nothing to do with medication so couldn't see the light and then i was like i was sort of like i was feeling i was feeling very unwell like, i remember that well i was feeling very unwell and i and i, and I just feel i felt very weak because of the, the too much too much exercising and I was thin, and I and I was and I and I have and I was thin like I am now. And when when it happened a second time, because I nearly I could have passed out. When it happened a second time, I realized that I realized that I need to stop stop exercising and just do walking five days a week. So I do the the, the, the recommended NHS recommended exercise 
So, or the government's recommended exercise. So, what it is is that also, if I'm saying the right words, it, it was it, it wasn't long after that I realized that after all these years I'm I realized I'm actually addicted to exercising. Something might might never ne, might might not have heard of that before, but you know, people people can be addicted to all sorts of things, and 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 I've literally just found it out this year or recently that I am like I said before I am addicted to exercise but I didn't, but before that I didn't realize I didn't think I was addicted to, I was addicted I didn't realize I was addicted to anything I, I, I thought I was I was not addicted to anything at all and some of some of you might be thinking the same thing you, you're not you're not addicted to anything but you you might because you, you I wouldn't be surprised if you guys are young that, that are watching me because I'm 34 at the moment and it's not a case of you know you'll never find you never find it you you will find it as you get older and older you will eventually find it but once you find it you must do your best to try, try and control it because it could actually it could actually kill you as well if you if you exercise too much because you can see the footballers doing football you can see you can see you can see on the on the TV how many how many footballers collapse on on, on in the middle of the pitch after well when they when they're exercising and and playing football so but but you can you can also say that anything anything can make can kill you if you have too much of it which is true and everything in moderation but I was definitely doing the recommended amount of exercising. Sometimes, if we do too much of of the, if we if we, I was doing the recommend, I was doing the under under recommended amount of exercising three days a week. And, but the, but some of us, so, uh. Just trying to think now. Uh, sometimes you don't really the ex the, the addiction with the addiction you you we are, like I said we have to try and control it because we don't because it could it could easily kill us because because of because of of the circumstances that 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 we're in. I'm not making any sense at the moment. Yeah, so we must we must control our, our addictions because it could be the, it it can it can eventually kill us. And yeah, I've literally run out of things to say. So before I finish, let's let let me just pray unless I have to say anything afterwards. So Heavenly Father, thank you for your grace and mercy you put upon us. Thank you for past, present, and future. Help us to know our addictions, O oh God, and realize our addictions without and and help us not to deny our deny help us, Father, not to deny our addictions because especially when it comes to being being alcoholic, we we, we don't believe or, or gambling, we don't believe that we're addicted to that substance. But I pray, Father, that we help us to come to realization of that, Father. Help us not to deny the recommended amount that we're meant to if we if we deny our Help us not to, not to deny our addictions, oh God, but I pray help us to to understand and come to, con, to com, let it come to a conscience of our addictions, oh God. I pray by Jesus Christ on the situation, pray not to fall upon our situation. I pray moving our lives, oh God, help us to control ourselves, help us help us to be self-controlled, like Your Word says, oh God. And and help us to find our identity in Christ Jesus, in Jesus Christ, in the blood of Jesus. I pray for healing and restoration in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray, Amen. 
yeah, like I said in the prayer, we might be in denial, in denial of, of our, I think I've said that already. Let me leave it there because I'm just rabbiting on. So God bless, take care and peace, peace be with you. Bye for now.